What's that you're using there? Autofocus? Sorry to hear that. I didn't realize you were so far beneath me as a human being. You're less evolved. Today we talk about manual focus snobs and their place in society and why I choose to experience the joy of autofocus should I so desire it. Let's talk about it. All I want is the perfect camera. All I want is the perfect camera. So we're gonna have some fun today. We got the Panasonic G9 with a manual focus lens to illustrate a point, the Laowa 7.5 mm Tony 2. And I brought the Sony A7S III with the Tamron 70 to 180. And we'll try to, I'll show you not only how difficult it is to try to track something manually, but I also will switch to the 12 mil Tony 2 to compare it to the warpy wobbly ways of life. Are we experiencing them? I find on this, if you walk like a normal human being, you get those warpy trees. So you gotta be careful with it. No warpy stuff if you're slow. Although you can get around it by putting a border up and then this is your vlog. Where's the warpy stuff now? I hit it. The center's stable, like my emotions. Not gonna lie to you, I want that dresser, but you can't see it right now because it's off in the distance. I've manually focused on it and I'm gonna track it as I approach it. I do not have any idea which way to turn the thing. There it is. Oh, we've already approached, approached the minimum. I can't see anything. The sun's glaring my eyes. I was going the wrong way. That does make sense. Oh, Panasonic can't double tap to reacquire focus while recording. Oh, you piece of shit. Why is there sirens? Is that an illegal feature? I think it, Panasonic broke the law. Just as a little side tangent. It's little things like that that matter. The like Sony cut up and it's full frame. I can't really recommend Micro Loser. Who is that? Can we focus on it? Is that breaking the law? Did I do it? I went the wrong way. He left already. So first, let's talk about the manual focus snobs that ambush you from within their little cave house that they built when they were seven. Just the arrogance. It's like, oh, you use autofocus? That's so amateur. I always know what I'm doing. I do this. Yeah, I've seen your wedding videos, scrub. They're out of focus. They're like, oh, they're, no, they're artfully out for a second, but I reacquire it as I move in. I drift. It's a drifting autofocus method. They teach you that in manual focus school. I went. My parents paid for it. I will now demonstrate to you Panasonic's autofocus system that they wish they had. A snooty ass wedding filmmaker. It's not art. You're just, you're capturing someone else's love. Your heart is empty and broken inside. Let's start there. And then, it actually is a skill. It's not easy. Let's track some shit. Actually, no. I'm gonna track things after and insert that into this video artfully interspersed throughout time. Okay, this may seem unethical, but I'm gonna track a human being. He's about to appear. Oh, where is he? Okay. I gotcha. I gotcha, buddy. Don't worry, I'm not pointing it at you, I promise. Uh, am I getting him? Don't worry, it's, it's, it's another subject I'm looking at. I do have notes, by the way. It may not seem like it, but... So we talked about the manual focus snobs a bit. Relax, snobs. The difficulty of it I'm displaying through the B-roll footage with the Tamron. Manual focus lens, not by wire. That's, it only made sense in my mind. This mainly applies to Panasonic hobos. You hear them in the comment section, oh, I just use manual focus. Most lenses are not manual focus lenses. It's the wire shit, the electronic, and it's not accurate and it's difficult and annoying. So you have this, Panasonic should 100% every single lens they make have a manual focus clutch that's real. Like the Sony Macro, the Olympus 12 mil Tony too. Oh, the beauty, the beauty, he's focused on a twig. But what if you wanted to see the background? Oh, wow. It was so easy for him. 
manual focus is hard enough with an amazing lens. Forget the wire stuff that doesn't do what you think it does. Although Panasonic does have like a linear mode, so it's like it will do exactly what you say it will, we promise. But it doesn't. How's Sony out of focus with a manual focus lens? Is it better? <laughs> Is it glorious? We're on the 12 mil, the per gear 12 mil Tony 2, and we have active stab on and digital 1.2 plus like two extra notches. It's like 1.23 digital zoom, which there's dogs. Dogs of love. They were Tony. Dogs can be Tony. As they walk off into the sunset together, he acquires them. Brief oh, don't look back. Oh, what's over there? What's over there? That's something interesting. Where are they? Where's the couple of love? Oh, come on. I can't tell if I'm doing it. Where's the peeking, Sony? While I peek at them, how come you're not letting me know? Oh, the love is in their heart. I think I'm tracking. How about you? Okay, we've acquired her. She's been a... No, we're missing it. There. She's in. We got her. Don't worry, I'm not filming you. I know it may look like that. I know it looks suspicious. Don't trust your eyes right now. You don't know what you're looking at. I'm the one with experience here. I'm the photographer. I'm getting her. I wonder if she realizes what I'm doing. Oh god, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Okay. Has anybody seen my sun stars? Where are the sun stars? Oh, you're a twinkle in my eye. Wedding filmographer's dream right here. Captured. Can you just vlog like that? Sun stars the whole time? Can you even imagine it? Do I look sharp? I don't see why I wouldn't. Diffraction isn't real. Christopher Frost, he makes so many mistakes in that assumption, doesn't he? Yes, he does. I'll stop down. Another annoying factor about manual focus, it may just be me, but I never remember which way does which. Is left the macro and right? Never, because I film myself, so it's backwards, and then I flip it around, and I'm like, which one was... This goes for all areas of life. I don't remember any, when there's two options to anything ever, I just, I flip them. How are you supposed to remember? And some lenses do it the other way. It's like, oh, we flipped it. We don't like how you did it. It's, everybody should get along. There should be one mount for every single, the mount. It's the mount, yeah. Your lens, of course it's the mount. What else would it be? And then we share. What happened to sharing and caring? for each other. Is this art? Is that wheat? Am I getting gluten poisoning right now? Okay, this should be an interesting test. I'm focused on that. Oh God, and I'm gonna track it. Oh, the wrong way. See, that happens every time. Okay, I'm gonna track it. <laughs> Damn you, Sony stabilization. We're at 180 mils. Oh, that's easy. Oh, this is easy. This is so cinematic. I can't believe how much cinema we're witnessing right now. I'll be honest with you, when it comes to videos like this, and you're handheld on a super wide lens, and you can see the peaking, I should be in focus. It's not the sharpest lens in the factory of candles. I'm not gonna lie to you. But you should be able to see it. But when you start extending it on a tripod, things go to hell fast. I've seen the episodes, cat, My Cat from Hell. Yeah, it's like that. For example, if I wanted to be out here, now we have some trouble. It's hard to see that far away, double tapping. Okay, like you can't reach it. That's the problem on these tripods, so you have to kind of... Okay, we can do it. We can do this. There's no way I did it. And I can't tell, and then the sunshine lies to you. This could be it. And I stopped down to 2.8. What if I didn't do that? What if I didn't? Are we good? 
No, see, it's like there. I was way off. It's so hard to see. Then which way was it? That way? He's nailing it. So this becomes a serious problem. I started using the tripods like this to get away because we didn't have a wide lens like this. And to be honest, if you're super close, you distort your face like crazy anyway. So I wanted to kind of extend out there. It's a nightmare, absolute nightmare. Okay, here's a challenge. This cyclist, uh, I'm gonna get him the whole time. He's not gonna come out of focus once. He's already out. I overthought my abilities. Oh God, what's happening? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the next factor, if you're all into manual focus and your camera can't autofocus and you're forced into that life, you don't get to experience the joy of autofocus. It's fun to be tracked by a camera and you're running and it's fun. Shut up, you don't know what fun is. Easter at your family, that wasn't a fun night. Your family sucks. Your turkey's dry. See, look at these fun times you're missing out on. Oh, I can't go very far. Oh, damn cords. Oh, why am I so against wireless technology? Honestly, though, it adds a dimension of fun to my videos. Like, I enjoy doing it, just leaning in the odd time, and it's like, it's tracking you. And I talk with my hands a lot, and the Sony doesn't get distracted by that. See? They remember that you're on a manual focus lens. Speaking of alcoholic families, am I seeing this right? Do we have like 15 crates of wine bottles? How much wine do you drink? It's all full of wine bottles. I'm in the wrong neighborhood. Okay, let's see Sony's tracking autofocus. I've tapped on a flower. It's tracking it and walking towards it. Oh God, that's shaky. Oh, Sony, you suck. Okay, so that was okay, I guess. We reached the minimum focus distance. Okay, let's see if I can beat it in manual focus. Okay, I have also enabled tracking of my own mind and I'm doing it. I'm doing it good. <laughs> Which was smoother? <laughs> was mine smoother? I do believe it was. Oh, how lucky are we. The cinema is approaching our lives. Free of charge. Free of charge. I'm bringing it in a notch. We made some adjustments. Speaking of adjustments. Okay, we got a car. We got a car. No problem. Not one second of that was in. The last factor is, it's kind of funny at your expense in your videos when your autofocus system fails. You miss out on those humorous moments because you're a manual focus snob. The funniest part is when you manually focus and you miss it. You're a moron. Oh, that's hard. I didn't do it this video. I know what I'm doing. I've been doing this a long time. And then you forget where you were holding it. That's the problem as well. We stopped down at 24 just to have a chance. But it's like, okay, I said it, and then, okay. You move. You're a human being. Okay, young doggy. Is there any way to discreetly do this? All right, I'm turning to the left. It doesn't look like I'm looking at them. Oh, the little puppy. Oh, he's coming too close. Oh, I'm missing it. I can see the peaking line. I'm not even close. Oh, God damn it. Am I nailing it? <laughs> So bottom line here, autofocus can be a tool, a useful one, a fun one. Joy can be had, and you can get better results from it. Nowadays with Sony, Canon, Nikon, Fuji sometimes, every company but Panasonic, they get you. It's like, you're going to miss, and you can call it artful. It's like, oh, I'm reacquiring it. Reacquire a taste for cat food, asshole. Hey, little buddy. Oh. Come on, you're my buddy. I can't tell at all. There, I think I got him. Do I have him? I've nailed it. It was so smooth. I have his eye in focus. As I approach him. I forgot which direction to turn. 
Yeah, it's getting chilly. That wind is blowing. Once I got here, my hands are so cold. But beauty will be ours in a second. We're at it. Lens flares and city life. None of it's in focus. We got another contestant. You see how hard this is? I suck. I suck really bad at it. There. We got him. Is he looking at me? No. All I can say is I have a lot more fun making videos with autofocus. It just adds fun to my videos, so I enjoy it. And I know a lot of professionals that use it autofocus during their films that they're getting paid for like wedding shit it just works if you can rely on it if you don't have a panasonic pony boy so let me know your thoughts manual focus is that the higher art or is autofocus good enough in your heart i'm gonna leave after you buy a camera conspiracy t-shirt subscribe for everybody else and now I'd like to demonstrate to you the classic, my neighbor has several bags of leaves, whereas my house is less important and I only have one lonely bag, which is in perfect focus. And then he zooms in on it. And then he reacquires focus so smoothly. Wow, that's, you've seen that exact shot in a movie, I'm sure. I am so sure of it. This Tamron lens has one of the longest, most annoying focus throws. Look, I'm turning it. I'm turning and turning and turning and I think we finally reached it. My God, it takes forever. How could anybody do this? And then to the hydrant, where dogs pee. Like, look how long that takes. It would be so much smoother with autofocus.